Hello everyone. Welcome to IEEE Expert YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show how to use deep learning model to predict student engagement level in their online classes. This is very interesting as well as useful project for online classes. Why because we have to predict student engagement level. It's a must and mandatory for online classes. It's hard to measure the students are engaged or not in online classes. So that this project very much useful for online classes one. Student engagement is the degree of how students have their performance, how they engage in the classes. It's important to measure the student engagement level. Student engagement level directly prop uh, proportional to the student performance. It's very complicated to uh, predict the student engagement level in online classes. Why? Because there is a less feedback between the teacher and students in online classes. So it's important to predict the engagement level in the online classes. Those students which are having high engagement level, they are directly pro uh, performed higher in their exam. So it's must to predict the engagement level in online classes. Student engagement is the level of certification, attention students have there in their learning process. It's important to measure student engagement level. One of the possible way to predict the student engagement level in online classes was facial expression. By using the facial expression, we can predict the student engagement level. Facial expression is the one of the spontaneous or very useful method to predict everyone's emotion, how their attention, how they are having involvement in that classes. So we have to use facial expression to predict that emotion level, predict that engagement level. By predicting their engagement level, we can test their learning level by giving so much feedback, personalized feedback to them. By providing those personalized feedback, we can enhance their learning process. So this process is very much useful for that process only. In this project, we are using deep learning model, which is called LSTM RNN, long short term memory as well as regional conversion neural network. We are combining these two algorithm to form a deep learning model. This model will take student face as their input. By using student face, it will extract the randomized features. Uh, chin level, nose level, eye position, eye tracking, head position, it will uh, mouth position, it will track all those data. By using all those data, it will predict the student engagement level. Varies from 1 to 10. Depends upon the engagement level, as I mentioned earlier, we can give the personalized educational plan for them. So this is the project which you are going to discuss today. Please connect with this video. We do give more interesting detail about this project, how the model works, how we are going to train. Everything will be discussed in this project as well as the complete demo of the project also given in this video. This is the project base paper which you are going to discuss today. The project base paper named as Analysis of Facial Expression to Estimate the Level of Engagement in Online Lectures. This is the base paper which is published on IEEE. Actually, this is the flowchart they are referring. They are considering facial expression for the engagement prediction. The algorithm they are using KNN, Knowledge Neighbor Network. This is the algorithm they are using. Actually, they are considering the eyebrow position, the lip position, the cheek position, then the dimpler, lip stuck, eye blink. Those are the facial features they are considering while implementing this project. But the main drawback of this paper was they are achieving 92% as a accuracy. To overcome that low accuracy, we are going for the enhancement, modification, which is our proposed system. Let's discuss our proposed system in a PPT format. This is our project presentation. Student engagement prediction using deep learning. This is the project title. Abstract. We are given abstract that in our project, instead of the KNN, we are going to use recurrent neural network as a proposed model. The recurrent neural network model will overcome the traditional KNN drawbacks with a high accuracy. Also, we are also going to consider facial emotions only. This is the features of the project. It can support live video. It can support live images. Six type of engagement level. Level engaged, highly engaged. Highly engaged in like the topic, not engaged, not engaged, sleeping. Those are the levels involved in the student engagement. The RNN accuracy was 98%, which is higher when compared to the previous models. Introduction in introduction, we are given that uh, in future, everyone going to the online mode of education format only. 
currently everyone using mostly online format of education even you are also watching this pro- project on youtube only online mode was rapidly growth but here the main problem was you can, i don't know whether you are watching this video with full engagement or not i don't know i didn't have any feedback if you are i am teaching in a live manner means i can know your facial manner your facial position and all i can come to know about your level of engagement but in online mode it's impossible nearly that's why you are going to for this project online facial feature extraction for student engagement level prediction the existing system as we mentioned earlier we are using knn here the main drawback of knn was accuracy was very low even 92% which is very less when compared to the standard uh, actually the main drawback was it will detect only one emotion the gain and least to over fitting also it's less effective sensitive if you are feeling noisy uh, low light images means it won't work proposed system we are using a recurrent neural network which is very higher in accuracy we got 98 percentage accuracy nearly 99 percentage accuracy also with uh, rnn we are combining lstm long short term memory model for proposed prediction we are using student facial expression as a data set we are going to train that data set only also we are going to find out accuracy precision recall with this project this is the overall architecture of the project first step we have to acquire images using live camera images then we have to apply pre processing we have to extract the background we have to extract the facial features at all then we have to estimate the eyebrow position eyebrow coordinates facial features uh, nose position chin position mouth position mouth opening eye closing eye movement eye tracking everything we can learn going to find out from that we have to find out student engagement level the training data also data set also contains same type of images only we have to use lstm model model to train as well as testing this project the models involved in the project was data set collection model pre processing model then model selection which is a recurrent neural network model then early detection means you are going to predict the level of engagement those are the models involved in the project data set collection involved in you have to collect various images for each and every uh, every levels first level of engagement second level of engagement last level of engagement you have to collect various student images for that pre processing you have to convert the images into same format without any noise or uh, background noise blur like that then model selection you have to implement a particular lstm rnn model for training as well as testing purpose of this project the early detection model will uh, support live web camera to detect the fa- student facial features from that it will estimate how much level of engagement they got with this online mode main advantage is was it can support multiple level of detection high capacity rnn tend to high capacity adaptability you can use a wide range of ima- uh, data even images video anything you can use with this project continuous improvement the researchers providing more support on rnn for uh, nowadays so the algorithm can be updatable that's the main advantage is here hardware for the implement of this project you need minimum 4 gp of ram minimum i3 ra- i3 processor we are going to use python html for developing this project the framework using django framework with the sql support in conclusion we have given that this project completely involved in deep learning technology to predict level of student engagement in online classes uh, which is which uses the facial expression to predict the level of engagement this study was very feasible study as well as effective study for future generation this is what we are given in the conclusion also reference for this project also given please uh, connect with this video next we are going to move to the demo of the project To run this project we have to go to the project location this is the project code you can see data folder we have mentioned the training data in training data we have taken various level of emotions for the students engaged like the topics engaged in showing involvement engaged in paying attention not engaged in chatting not engaged in the confusion state not engaged not like the topic not engaged in feeling sleepy these are the levels involved in the project overall seven type of emotion we are taken for each level we are taken images also for each levels we are taken images also you can see everything here each levels we are taken images also to run this project we have to use this code to run 
python space manage.py this is the code i'm going to use so i'm just copying the project location i'm just copying the project location just open the anaconda navigator open the project environment after opening the project environment i'm going to type cd space project location then type enter python space app.py sorry python space manage.py space run server this is the command i'm going to use for the running that's it once you type the means it will verify the code once the code running means it will show the local status so actually the system was performing the execution part we have to wait for the system to compile so once system compiled means just copy the project location just paste it on any browser that's it so i'm pasting in the browser this is the project home page you can see this is the project home page which we are showing here uh, before uh, one minute you need more machine learning project means please visit our website iwexpert.com we do provide more projects with a complete documentation support so i'm running the project here two persons are there one is admin another one is student two persons are there first i'm registering in the student things so first i'm going to the registration part i'm just typing here i'm just typing my username will be ramesh my student id will be ramesh my password will be kumar dollar 321 mobile number 9966332211 this is my mobile number email id kumar001 at gmail.com Okay, I'm giving city as Chennai, state as Tamil Nadu. Just I'm typing uh, locality Chennai. Just register. Once registered means you are successfully registered. It's showing you are successfully registered. Now go to admin. Admin password also admin. This is the username password I'm going to use. just give login once login success means just go to the tab in the tab you can find ramesh ramesh was registered here uh, everyone activated instead of ramesh everyone got activated just click activate now ramesh got activated now go to log out login with the student things i'm just using login id as a ramesh password as sir kumar dollar 321 that's it now everything working so this is my student tab just go to live live camera if you are clicking live camera means it will open the camera it will show you your level of engagement if you no project running so login activated student id 11 activated so found images also seven classes loading now it will open the web camera so once the web camera open the means you can see i'm just listening the classes so it's uh, telling that pay attention it's showing perfectly everything okay now i'm if i'm telling
now you can see when i'm smiling and chatting can you show you are chatting if i'm in the confusion state means it uh, clearly saying here you are in confusion state as well as if i am listening clearly saying paying involvement making attention is clearly working perfectly to work also you can check with the images also to check with the images click the video press q that's it now you can go to the images folder you can upload and check with any images i'm just choosing any images for that i'm just going to picture camera roll i'm just selecting any images once image is selected means just click upload it will open the image here just to close that's enough your result will come emotion now go to the rnn tab here in the rnn tab you can see accuracy is 1.0 that means nearly 100 percent accuracy we got uh, so you can get your complete table how much time you are chatted how much time you got interruption in the class how much time you are not engaged how much time you are physically presented with the project what's your overall performance in the classes how much time you are in the confusion state it will give the complete result of your scenario perfectly this project will work okay this is your result now what i'm going to means i'm just clicking log out just go to the admin in the admin i'm going to use admin id admin admin i'm going to use just to go to admin here you can see students data each student data you can see also you can see directed you can see directed level of each person even ramesh complete state you can find here okay also you can check individual student performance result also here each and every student individual performance students depends upon that student id how much what's their overall performance everything you can see here okay to get this project please contact itpexpert.com we do provide this project at best price thank you please subscribe to our channel we do provide more interesting topic like this